One of the tricks of the enemy, and the end times talk about this, is going to be the intentional blurring of <laughs> distinctions that allow us to be free, that allow us to grow closer to God. And every single one of them is laid out in the first 11 books of Genesis. For example, the distinction of God and man, that we are not God and we should worship God, but we are made in the image of God, as it says in Genesis 1:26 and 127. As it says in Genesis 1:1, which is the verse that changes everything. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. That means that there is a being greater than you that has a purpose for you to be here, that your existence is not a mistake.